What's up YouTube? It's What's Pumping. Just another quick update if uh, the V-Boost module works. Uh, I just installed it in the truck over here. You see it? It's right down here. Plugs into the OEM harness to the computer. And it's right down here to the alternator. I got a couple of subscribers. Uh, I sent me some comments on my YouTube channel and they were saying let me know if it works, if uh, the voltage increases or does it really make a difference this uh, product from ZZ Performance. So what I'll do is uh, I'll start the truck up and I'll show you guys uh, if the voltage increases. The old voltage was 14.4 uh, volts when it's warm and 15 volts uh, cold. So we'll see if we get more than 14.4 volts uh, whenever uh, the motor is warm with the V-Boost module. And uh, I'll show you guys uh, the results. Okay YouTube, uh, we're going to start this truck and we're going to see how the voltage is. You see the voltage over there? Nothing is reading because the truck's off. So we'll see, we'll see right now when we start this truck exactly what happens if the V boost module works from ZZ Performance it's in the night we got some lights on here because we want to get every snapshot what's what happens the light so far is 12.5 that's the regular battery we'll see right now what happens when we start this truck how much uh, volt increases it's cold Look at that. Oh my god. 17.3 volts. Holy shit. Look at that. 17.3 guys. Cold. 17.3. Let me zoom this in. Oh shit. 17.4 on a cold start guys. Already almost over 2.5 volts. Over 2.5 volts higher. On a cold starting, usually my my, my, my my cold starting is about 15, and this already increased it by like two volts. Holy shit! Oh my god, I don't I don't believe it. But look at that, guys. We'll see what happens when the truck is warm, and then I'll show you guys uh, the voltage meter uh, when it comes warm, how low it's gonna be. This is totally incredible. I cannot believe already how the voltage just increased. It's what's pumping, and I'm gonna keep you updated just in a minute, and I'll show you when it's uh, I warm. My God, an incredible product from ZZ Performance, guys. Check it out. This thing actually works. Okay, guys, the voltage is 16.2, 16.3. Let me zoom in here a little bit. 16, 16.4, 16.2 to 16.4. So two and a half uh, volt increase. It works. The V Boost module. The only problem is with this V-Boost module, sometimes your dash lights will get off messed up here. You know, we have like a, a battery light here lit up and says service, uh, I don't know, anyway, if you guys can see here. Uh, uh, service uh, engine soon over there. I'm thinking because the alternator is tricked by the voltage. So the computer's not recognizing the voltage, so your la dash lights lit up. What I've noticed is there's a difference in the the current draw with the voltage. It hits harder the 15s in the in this truck. Sometimes, uh, you know, actually no, it works. Uh, the RPM gauge. Sometimes your RPM gauge might not work, or uh, your speedometer might go left and right. Sometimes that's just because, like I said, the voltage is going up, and then the voltage is going down from the current draw when you're cracking up the system. But uh, eventually, when it becomes more stable and warm, idle the truck, and you're driving, everything will be all co collaborated, and uh, it'll be back to normal. The the diagnostics of the computer. You just have to reset the uh, the computer. See, it's actually it's responding now, so it works. So it takes time to get used to your system. This voltage uh, V boost module. It sounds good, guys. The system sounds good. Uh, can't crack it up too much uh, it's in the night here so like I said it's easy performance for the win V boostage module guys check it out uh, for 25 bucks like I said uh, a little uh, gadget will help out uh, 
your your audio system every system is different every charging system is different uh, I'm surprised I got two and a half volts uh, I thought I was gonna get maybe one volt or a volt and a half but for some reason I got two and a half volts maybe because I got uh, uh, two zero gauge uh, wires running to the back with uh, six Optima deep cycle batteries plus because I have um, a high performance uh, alternator 260 amp uh, fad uh, hybrid alternator pro series from nations that's probably why I get a little bit more current draw but maybe some other systems that they have a regular stock alternator may not get that kind of uh, voltage input maybe a little bit less than uh, 16 volts who knows so it's uh, what's pumping guys peace out and take care guys for now bye bye